Hey guys, welcome to Unity Tutorial. Um, this tutorial is going to be pretty short. It's going to show you how you can use a big amount of grass with uh, and let your nature optimize it for you. So what I have in here is the flat scene demo, which comes with the asset. And it's a very, very basic uh, demo right here. We have some grass. And I'm going to go ahead and show you the grass prototype in here. Uh, you will you'll be able to see that the max generatable density, which is basically the max, the max density that this grass could uh, basically show, is assigned to 10. So let's extend that to 20. That will allow us to do to basically basically paint twice the amount of density. And when you do that, you also have to repaint the grass to a higher density. So let's just do that. And make sure we do not create new instances. And there you go. Paint a little bit. Okay. Now you will have a much much dense grass. Grass. Now if I disable the LOD features, which you can, the LODs feature, which, which you can see over here. If I get away from the grass, you can see this lower and lower and lower density. You would see that basically, if I disable it, the density is going to be the same for each distance, as you can see here. So let me just go ahead and play the game, and you can see that without having all these on, we have 4.3 million verdicts, which is not really the real amount, but anyways and 100 FPS. Now if I enable the LODs, we can get more or less the same look, but twice as less uh, dense uh, vertex and almost third, uh, 30 percent more, uh, not almost, but a bit more than 30 percent more uh, FPS. Um, now if we, that's actually a way for us that we can have better LODs if we just actually play with this around. So let's use less, de less density for the first LOD, for the second and for the third one, and reduce the amount of density we get for each one. So let's get here this amount, this amount over here, and this amount over here. Now we have a lot less density, and if we start the game, if we go to full play, you're going to see we get much less vertex and much better FPS. And we don't really need to do anything, see so there's like a big difference right here, but in some cases you might actually not notice it as much. And when we go over the map, you can see it just gets affected pretty much, pretty nicely. So really well, by playing with the LODs value, you can get really good results. So it really depends on how you play with it. And again, just for showcase, if I disable the LODs we get in here, even more than twice the, the vertex, and a lot less FPS, but if I go ahead and enable the LODs, Back, back again, we get again twice less, twice as less of a vertex and pretty much the same FPS. Uh, not a bit more FPS, but if I remove the trees, you're gonna be able to see it much more clearly. So if I remove the trees from the terrain, just like that, you can see that with the LODs, we basically get 170, right? And without the LODs, We're actually getting 110, so it's actually almost twice as much uh, FPS. Now, if we disable the image effects, you're going to see more, but that's pretty much the overall um, advantage of using it, uh, LODs and how it can actually help you use more grass. So that's basically it for this tutorial. Uh, it's a very short one, as I said, just going to show you how to use the LOD system, and uh, yep, that's it.